Hello everybody, I am Raymond19 and welcome to episode number 11 of our France campaign in European Versailles 4 as we are uh, playing in the Emperor DLC in the 1.30 patch. Going okay, um, we've been beating up on Iberia but we can't go east. You know, typical I guess kind of France. Uh, we just really can't go anywhere that we really want to go. So, we'll just have to deal with it. There's nothing we can do. Austria keeps getting reelected, and they're just going to keep on pushing their own reforms. Uh, there's probably zero chance of a Protestant or you know any kind of le any kind of leagues to go about. And they're trying to get built up up here, but I think they've kind of handled the issue. Um, beta peasantry. Spend some money. Wayne's done excellent. Um, guess I'm going to go ahead and start here. I, I do need to get it done. Hmm. I mean, there is a possibility of doing a French Mexico, but I can let him do all the work on that. Never mind. Go here. It's gonna be very powerful. Hoping French Columbia gets itself together here shortly. There we go. Nave uprising chance is like none. Global tariffs. Envoy trade. Okay, now let me take a look at this really fast. Hmm. Uh, da, 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 da. Is it... Stability. There it is. Okay. Um. So we took this. Nave uprising chance minus 50% and nave assimilation up 50%. Now, with that idea, nave uprising is now negative 100% chance and plus 100% chance for them to assimilate. So that, that should just be like they pop up, right? It pops in, they give it to me. That's just how I see it. We'll see. I don't know how that really works. Foreign spy detection's fine. Yep, Santiago. Let's go ahead and send up to Adai as well. Might as well go and get two going. I actually can go ahead and start pushing from somewhere else now. Um, Push that trade power we have there onward. Cherokee and Choctaw, which are probably like right both here. Go side by side. Get cover. Yeah. He moved one, actually. No thanks, Lorraine. And we can't vassalize him yet.
Uh, we're going to go with this prestige here. I should have done that one earlier, but it's all right. We probably have a lot of trade. We probably don't have the best trade because we don't control these three trade nodes here. Um, Paris gets 25. Did I really... Did I spawn it? Oh, it wasn't even trade. It was printing press. That's what it was. So printing press is going to work its way. Through all of our territories, actually. It started here in Heidelberg in the Platinate. But we should do well towards bringing it in. Um... Yeah, we just got to keep pushing this stuff on. Lose some of that manpower. Let's go ahead and look at what we can do here. Nothing. Here. Nothing. Here. Do that. Nope. Get a few of those manufactories done. British West Indies is a thing. We're going to let these guys kind of do their own thing through here. Like, I want them to make up their own little in West Indies, East, you know, all that crap. Because I'm going to end up putting stuff in place to take it over. Lose 10 legitimacy. Price of fur goes up. Don't think... Yeah, we have found fur. Good. Conquistador. Go hunt. I'm just going to go see where all these nations are. They'll do that for me. This is at 0.15, so it's starting to go down by the looks of it. There's Kato. There's the Choctaw. Sure, there you go. We're gonna help out our we're gonna help out Russia. I can really become a good ally. We're replenishing manpower. Morale of navies is up. Take a look at our subject, Naples. I think I need to wait till I get the they forced uh, us into a union and the backward monarch's gone, and then I'll force them into I'll enforce religion on them. Put two here on both of those. Do we have any inflation? Not really. Not, not enough for me to want to go put a guy on it. 
Uh, yearly prestige might be the thing we go for. He lost, but he killed a bunch of them. Let's go ahead and bring this guy in, Annex him. That's going to lead to a mission getting done, I know. An alliance offer from Venice. Venice, where even are you? Down here? Yeah, no. No, sir. Local settler increased by plus 25. Native uprising chance by minus 20. And native assimilation plus 40. So it's 140... Native assimilation. Here in the number one place right. 115 actually. I'll lose 10 prestige actually. I think we've already discovered that the colonial trade region here, yeah. That's the Ohio. Great efficiency. I so said we're just going to start them. We don't really care about the rest. We just want to start them. Like one, two, three, four, five. Right there. Boom. Then he can start blowing up himself. Then I'll switch over here and do one, two, three, four, five, you know, around this and have our Mexico. Okay. Do you have another leader? No. Portuguese separatist at seventy percent. Oh wow, the Antilles have done really well. He's now covered up that island. Nouvelle New Orleans is now done. And that guy moved back? That's not right. I guess technically, though, I could move forward. Okay. To maintain stability. Oh my gosh, it takes forever to pay that stuff off. We'll do that. That. Who cares what Burgundy thinks? 
I certainly do not. Three Catholics in uh, Managua. French Columbia, what's wrong with you? Now you're building up some infantry. Okay. How's our institution spreading? 65, 26, 25, 25. Okay, we're doing fairly well. And it's going to spread throughout all these areas pretty equally. Um, but once it starts, it's going to be like a tidal wave. Some annexation done. I'm going to go ahead and kill that. Where is Bjorn? Oh, whoops, I can't do Fiburn. It is Burn. Here we go. Go ahead and send that guy around to die. I can't go inward, can I? Nope. Well, we'll go ahead and start here. I'm going to put this guy in Brado. Actually, no, I'm going to recall from there. And I'll send here. Go one, two, three, four, five. Have my Brazil. Two, three, four. Some zealots kick down. Yeah, still very low, one eighty two. He's got plus zero. I don't know if that's uh. I wonder what that's about. There are 28 heretic princes in the empire. So he's not gaining anything. And there will probably be more as these things continue on. I mean, they're going to have to switch. Could fight Denmark. <laughs> uh, let's let these build out. We're going to want to get the next text when we can. Yes, Scotland. We're keeping our, you know, words to you the best we can. Yeah, 
There's Caribbean Separatist. Getting close here. Institution. Seventy-eight point two eight. An alliance from the Ottomans. Do I really want to do that? Cause uh Ragusa taking on Hungary. You only have Prussia as an ally? And there's actually a Prussia? Okay. Yeah, I can't see the Ottomans being a good choice now. Okay. Wish I could do that. Say, all right, I'm done. We're going to war. I want you to lose your imperial authority. Any more money? We're just getting money everywhere. This guy's just not good. Aragon declared war on Castile. We'll be breaking a truce. How long do we have until that's over with anyway? Like a few months, less than a year. That production efficiency goes up. Do that. Colonial range. Let's go and get burn going. This is sitting at what? 507. Did I just do Diplotech? I did, so yeah. That's fine. Those. Um, he's way out there. He's sitting there at 390, about to figure out what he's going to get. Um, I 
All right, he's getting grain. Okay. All right, guys, I do need to end it here. Um, when we come back, we're going to focus on trying to figure out how to fix this issue. Um, I might have to end up moving a pretty large army down here just to kind of keep them quelled for a little while. I don't really want to do that. I'd rather use this up here and go to war, but we'll figure out what all we need to do. So, uh, matter of fact, you can actually see here, I could declare war on uh, Portugal again. I'll probably go ahead and start building up a spy network for. Um, so yeah. All right, guys. Well, I appreciate you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check out link for Discord, Twitch, and Patreon in the description below. And I will see you all next time.